Tsar tank. Design origin, the Tsar tank, also known as the Lebedyanka tank, was a Russian experimental tank designed during World War I. Designer, the tank was designed by Nikolai Lebedyanka, a Russian engineer, and was intended to overcome the challenging terrains of the Eastern Front. Year of design, the Tsar tank was designed in 1914 and construction began in 1915 during the reign of Tsar Nicholas II. Unique tricycle design, one of its distinctive features was its tricycle design, with two large front wheels measuring about 27 feet in diameter and a smaller rear wheel. Purpose, the tank was intended to navigate difficult terrains such as swamps and trenches, providing a solution to the challenges faced by traditional tanks. Crew compartments, the tank had multiple crew compartments, including a central cabin in the body of the tank and a separate cabin in each of the front wheels. Armament, the Tsar tank was equipped with two naval 76.2mm Pudilov M1902 guns, one in each of the large front wheels. Engine, the tank was powered by a 250 horsepower aircraft engine, which proved to be insufficient for the massive size and weight of the tank. Speed and maneuverability, despite its size, the Tsar tank had limited speed and maneuverability, and its large wheels made it vulnerable to artillery fire. Failed trials, the tank underwent trials in 1915, but it faced numerous issues, including difficulties with turning, instability, and an inability to cross trenches. Abandonment, after a series of unsuccessful trials, the project was abandoned in 1916. Only one prototype of the Tsar tank was ever built. Effect on tank development, the Tsar tank had little impact on the development of tanks during World War I, as it was considered impractical and ineffective. Historical curiosity, the Tsar tank is often regarded as a historical curiosity, representing an experimental phase in tank design. Photographic documentation, despite its limited use, the tank is well documented through photographs, providing a glimpse into its unconventional design. Post-revolution fate, after the Russian Revolution of 1917, the Tsar tank was left abandoned, and its parts were scavenged for other purposes. Propaganda usage, images of the Tsar tank were later used in Soviet propaganda to highlight the excesses and impracticality of the pre-revolutionary regime. Recognition of flaws, the Tsar tank's design flaws, particularly its vulnerability and lack of practicality, were recognized even during its development. Symbol of technological overreach, the Tsar tank is often cited as an example of the dangers of overambitious and impractical engineering projects. Cultural references, the Tsar tank has made appearances in various cultural references, including literature, documentaries, and video games. Influence on tank design, while the Tsar tank itself did not influence tank design, its failure contributed to the learning curve in the early development of armored warfare. Preservation efforts, no intact Tsar tank survives today, but some of its components are preserved in museums, providing a glimpse into this unique chapter of tank history. Engineering lessons, the Tsar tank serves as a historical lesson in engineering, highlighting the importance of practicality and adaptability in designing military vehicles. Size comparison, the Tsar tank remains one of the largest tanks ever designed, dwarfing many contemporary and modern tank designs. Public reception, the tank garnered public attention during its trials, with many people intrigued by its unconventional design and massive size. Legacy, the legacy of the Tsar tank lies in its symbolic representation of an era when military technology was rapidly evolving, with both successes and failures shaping the course of warfare.